Welcome to Ali at UGA's first series of remote classes made possible by Zoom. We appreciate you volunteering your time and knowledge to the Ali community. Today, we'll briefly cover how to use Zoom to teach an Ali course remotely from the comfort of your own home. In order to connect to Ali using Zoom, you'll need access to your email account. On the day of your class, an Ali staff member will email you a link unique to the course you're presenting. Start by opening your browser, navigating to your email account, and clicking the first link in the Ali email the staff has sent you. Upon clicking this link, your browser will open a new window, which should prompt a download of the Zoom software you'll be using. If the Zoom download does not begin automatically, simply click the link that reads Download and Run Zoom. Once Zoom is downloaded, for PCs, click the .exe file at the bottom of your browser window. For Macs, open your download folder and double-click the .pkg file to install Zoom. Once the installation is done, enter your name and click Join Meeting. If the host is not yet in the meeting, you may take this time to test your computer audio, get your camera angled properly, and make sure you're ready for your close-up. Once you're ready, click Join with Video in order to connect to the meeting. At first, an Ollie staff member will act as a host as you and your participants join the conference. If you feel comfortable with Zoom, you may opt to request the hosting role for yourself, allowing you to control the flow of your presentation. If you opt to host, you may toggle everyone's mute and unmute functions, which will serve to temper interruptions and questions. If you have a PowerPoint presentation, you'll want to ensure your class can see it. Start by opening PowerPoint on your computer and have your specific presentation standing by. Next, on your Zoom window, click on the green Share button at the bottom of the video feed. When a new dialog window opens, click on the PowerPoint option and then the blue Share button. Once the host gives the all clear, you're all set to teach your class. If you opt not to host, an Ali staff member will have controls allowing them to mute the class and turn off everyone's video feed. However, if a participant would like, they are able to ask questions by typing into the chat field throughout the presentation. As the instructor, feel free to address these questions at your leisure, whether it be at certain points throughout the class or at the end of the session. If you're allowing an ongoing discussion in which the whole class is unmuted, be sure to turn up your speakers in order to hear everyone. And that's it. You're now ready to teach your Ali class using Zoom. If you have any further questions, please feel free to direct them to our email at ali at uga.edu.